Even if you don't live or work in the grasslands, they're important to all Canadians. The Weston Family Foundation has been instrumental in NCC's approach to working in the grasslands and developing the relationships in the agricultural community. NCC is committed to conserving 500,000 hectares of grassland by 2030. In Canada, less than 20% remains. These are some of the most biodiverse places we have in Canada. It's literally billions of dollars of services that these wild areas are providing. Ranchers are some of the most conservation-minded people we work with. They understand the land, they understand how to keep it healthy. There's this mutually beneficial relationship between cattle production and ecosystem preservation. So one of the most effective tools we have is by working with these landowners to make sure that the grasslands they've protected and stewarded remain that way. I'm old enough to know that in this world I'm living in a pretty special spot and it's a responsibility to make sure it stays that way. It's fantastic working in it and with it and trying to enhance it. It's also really easy to throw it out of balance. So NCC became a logical partner for me and it's been great. One of the ways that NCC works with agricultural producers is through the Weston Family Foundation Stewardship Investment Program, or SIP for short. SIP is designed to help producers steward their lands in effective ways. What they're used for is flexible as long as they are mutually beneficial to the producer as well as the ecosystem that they're operating on. NCC works with our partners, including conservation easement holders, but also producers that either are working with community pastures that work with NCC or have some other relationship. And we really are just here to start the conversation and talk about what would be effective stewardship of these grasslands. We're here to help support the grant writing process and we can provide the technical and logistical expertise needed to complete an application and then help really steward the project. We've identified some key priorities like off-site watering, invasive species management, fencing systems to replace old barbed wire with wildlife friendly alternatives to allow wildlife movement, species at risk, monitoring and stewardship programs. There's just a wide array of opportunities and we're open to discussing anything as long as it benefits the environment and the rancher. To use this quarter, there's zero surface water because it's so dry, it's a non-starter. You're not using it if you don't develop the water. But it's become, along with everything else in the world, really expensive to do. To have this grant show up to help us, to have this development go in, it's awesome for this ranch going forward. What we're looking at is what I would call Christmas for Stephen Hughes. With this grant, we drilled a well, and then we've put a submersible pumping system in that's run off solar. It's a fantastic way to deliver water to cattle and to wildlife. The benefits just layer and layer and layer. It's a win-win opportunity for producers and conservation organizations. It's just an iconic piece of Canada. You drive through these beautiful prairies and it takes your breath away. We need to protect them and that's going to take everybody. <laughs>